Landed UFO. Gee, what? Where the freak did this heat come from? Maybe it's the base they're onto. The base, not us. Maybe because they're tracking the Sky Ranger, you know? Something? Assume they got our base. Assume they got our satellites. Assume they got us right here, right now. Everything. Assume it all. How are we going to defend the base if they attack? I'll front that. That's not a problem. What the hell happens with Exalt and our 750? Exalt? Listen, with the heat we got, you want to play World War II in the streets with Exalt? No, I want my 750. Want me to get a pass? I got more motivation to whack Exalt than either of you. They are a freaking luxury. Our problem is to take the landed UFO or let it go. Do not send troops. Do not react. Nothing. 30 seconds from now, we spin the hollow globe. That's it. Valen? The UFO is worth the risk. I need it, Bradford. We should stay and take it down. That's where I come out. I roll with you, Bradford. Whatever. Whatever. Not on this one, Commander. On this one, you're on your own. I figure this is the best thing to do. This is the best thing to do. I'm just an NPC. I make it to XCOM 2 no matter what, so for me the reward is maybe worth the stretch. But you're in an Iron Man run. You got healthy soldiers, decent base development, you got alloys and meld. If I were you, I'd be smart. I'd cut loose of this. Oh, you know, for me, the action is the juice. I'm in. Shen? Yeah, sure, why not? What's the worst that could happen? <laughs> Let's go. Are you friggin' serious? You wiped the whole squad? I told you that landed UFO was a trap, but you love Bradford, and you had to prove that for you, the action is the juice. Whatever the hell that means, you friggin' idiot.